What's going on my YouTube family? Welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys all my Balkan meals with protein, carbs, and fats on screen because all my viewers have been asking me what am I eating during the winter months for my Balkan. So let's get right into it. So these are all my examples of Balkan meals. Before I get into this, I want to talk to you guys about calculating your macros. I've done a video on it. You'll see it on top of the screen over here. So I'm not going to get too much into that. And for my bulking, because it's winter in Canada, uh, I like bulking, so I keep my calories around 20, 29,500 to 3,000 calories. And during spring, summer, I, I cut it back down to 27,500 2,800. That works generally the best for me. And there's no golden rule to fats and carbs. You gotta play around with it. When you watch my other video, you understand how I do it. It's really helped me uh, become more ripped, become more muscular. So let's get into the meal. So meal number one, I love eating eggs in the morning. I like scrambling my eggs with a bagel. And I also like mixing my vegetables. So it's red, red peppers, onions, spinach. I'll throw in some mushrooms sometimes. Just for the extra calories, variety with the food. It's great. It goes together. So that's meal number one. I like getting in my protein, a good solid meal in the morning. And for, so, and then I, I pre-gym, what I do is I give it a couple of hours, three hours, I do my work on the side. And great example of snacks is uh, an apple before the gym or a banana or rice cakes with peanut butter or this uh, beautiful heaven right here, a uh, bowl of heaven, which is blueberries, oats, and peanut butter. These are all great foods to give you that high energy before the gym where you're lifting heavy ass weights and it, and it fills your glycogen stores and you release all those glycogen in the gym and that's what helps you build the muscle. Post gym for my recovery meals. I love keeping in high carbs. I have three excellent examples of high carbs over here. Um, so I keep, I do chicken breast with rice and asparagus, or I do lean 5% ground turkey with sweet potatoes, um, green beans, or I'm giving you guys another example of a third meal, which is salmon, broccoli, and I'll add in some rice. Uh, so again, so post-workout, I'll do one of these meals. I'll give it a two hour break, then I'll do another meal and another two hour break, two and a half hour break and another meal. So I generally tend to consume around five full meals with two, two, two snacks. So snacks, another great example of snacks is almonds, walnuts. It's like a trail mix. I love it. Um, it it's just, it's just great because these kind of foods keep you full throughout the day. And uh, another example of uh, a meal when you're not feeling like having a lot of carbs is avocados and fish, uh, protein and fats, uh, very essential, very important. So these are just examples of all my bulky meals. What you can add on to this is like rice. Uh, yeah, and of course we have our protein here. I like doing uh, vegan protein because I feel like it's the cleanest, uh, it's giving me the best results, uh, leanest protein. There's no, there's no like golden rule to making a protein shake. You can throw in whatever you want. Just make it fit in with your macros. So I would keep it with fruits. I would keep it with protein shake. I would, you can add in whatever you want. Banana, spinach, honey. You gotta play around uh, with your macros and what fits your needs. So when you watch that video up on screen, you will have a better understanding of how I calculate everything. There's no golden rules for carbs and fats. It's whatever fits your needs. Some people operate better on more fats more carbs, but it's very important and essential to keep protein levels high. I would suggest starting off at 2.3 grams per kilogram of body weight and then assess it. So I'm around 200 grams of protein. Some weeks I, I, I tone it down, some weeks I tone it up. But I, I tend to stay in the range of 190 to 220 grams of protein based on my height, I'm six feet and based on my weight as well, right? So that's how I do it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for my nutrition plan and my exercise workouts. I'm gonna be releasing my website, I'm working on it. I got a full-time job, but it's coming, I promise you guys, but I hope this helps you for my viewers because they've been asking me, what are my macros? What are my meals looking like? These are all my meals laid out in front of you. I hope this video, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You know, I thank you for your time, for watching my videos and supporting me. I just wanna help people out there for sure. And stay safe out there because you know, the pandemic is still for real, at least in Canada. Uh, but yeah, let's keep making these games. Peace. What's going on with my YouTube fam? Today, I'm bringing you guys my full-fledged leg day, leg gains. 